Hello, I'm Sharon with Flat World Knowledge, and I'd like to welcome you all today to a brief podcast with Professor Miles McCrimmon, author of a new textbook with Flat World Knowledge. It's the Flat World Knowledge Handbook for Writers. Welcome to you, and and welcome, Miles. Hi, Sharon. Um, let's let's not keep our listeners waiting. Let's kick this off with a couple questions for you about your new handbook. Um, what made you decide to write a handbook for this course? Well, I think uh, professors and instructors all over the country will understand what happens after you've been teaching for many years. Um, you develop some ideas that don't fit into the existing textbooks that are out there, and um, that certainly has happened with me after 20, 25 years of teaching. I decided that it was time to try to share my ideas with my colleagues around the country, and, and Flat World certainly seemed to be the best vehicle to do that. And I had, I've had i not actually been using a handbook for many years myself, but I have long felt that it is a, a, it's an excellent foundation for a course, uh, provided especially that it doesn't necessarily just become kind of a, a reference document that sort of focuses on avoiding error, um, but instead can also serve as a kind of a writing guide as well. So that's one of the features of it that, that I'm most excited about. And speaking of that, that actually is a perfect segue into my next question. I'm sure our listeners would be interested in hearing kind of what sets the Flat World Knowledge Handbook for Writers apart from maybe the other handbooks on the market. Well, actually, the title itself is uh, is a happy accident because Flat World Knowledge, of course, is the name of the company. Uh, it feeds right into the fact that we're calling it a knowledge handbook, a Flat World mm-hmm. Knowledge Handbook. It's as much a knowledge handbook as it is really a handbook for writers. I think a lot of times the existing handbooks on the right on the, on the market are a little bit focused still on the mechanics of writing, and they also make certain assumptions, just like rhetorics do that there are certain kinds of college writing that, uh, that a student can expect to encounter. But I, I, I kind of rewind that point a little bit in the, in the front section of this, of this book and, and really kind of ask some, some underlying questions uh, to students. Why are you here? Why are you in college? What are you expecting to get out of it? Um, even some of the kinds of questions that you would associate maybe with a, a student development kind of book, I think there's some features of that going on here because if I've learned one thing as a, as a professor over the years, it is that if you can't get at the attitudes and the dispositions that students have as they're coming into, into your class, and they're coming from such a, such a diverse array of backgrounds, if you can't figure out why they're there, or if you can't, more important, have them figure out why, the, why they're there, no amount of coverage, really, of mechanics and of genres and of modes of writing is going to be, is going to be uh, successful. That's fantastic. Now, it's... it's uh... It definitely makes sense that as these students come in and take one of their first courses in in college, that they get some experience and some understanding and some a vehicle for which they can explore why they're there and 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 how they're going to get the most out of their college experience. So that's that's fabulous. And Miles, we've told you a number of times how pleased we are to have you here at Flat World Knowledge and how excited we are that you've you've chosen to publish uh, your handbook with us. You could have published with a number of the other traditional publishers, but again, we thank you for being here. Can you tell our listeners maybe why you decided to publish with Flat World? Well, you know, I think like a lot of other authors that are working for Flat World that are doing projects, uh, I first encountered Flat World as a potential consumer because I was very intrigued by the model of being able to get ready access to the best material that's out there and to possibly even have the option of... Uh, of overriding some of my own material on top of it or at least customizing it on the spot as I saw fit or even having my students do the same kind of thing. So I first had a conversation with the folks at Flat World really on behalf of my department thinking about things that we might be able to do to come up with a, a kind of a custom book. Later I realized that really um, this is the this is the best platform for doing the kind of project that I've been wanting to do for years, but with the traditional publishing houses, there's so many additional compromises inherent in the process in order to, to actually bring something to market. Um, to, you know, when your first option is really only print, and then after that you're thinking about ways of going online with the material. That just slows things down and adds all kinds of, um, uh, of hurdles and barriers that um, for somebody who's 
frankly, teaching as much as I am, it just was too much to take on. This is much more streamlined. I can really get straight to the point of, of what I want to share with my colleagues around the country. So, so that was my main uh, objective. And, and since I've gotten to know the people at Flat World, I, I am convinced that they really do have um, the students' best interest in mind. So, so I, I feel really proud of my association with Flat World. Oh, that's great of you to say. And, and we feel the same way about the authors who have chosen to publish with us because we think we are hopefully making things better for the authors out there, for the instructors out there, and, and you're right, especially for the students. So thank you, Miles, for uh, your dedication to your discipline and, um, and for the textbook that, that we're going to be publishing here. In, and um, and, and thank, for, thank you to all of you listeners out there for taking time to spend with us today to learn a little bit more about Professor Miles McCrimmon and the Flat World Knowledge Handbook for Writers. We'll look forward to partnering with you at some point in this semester.